Hello everyone, welcome to Joystick Lab. In the last tutorial, we saw that how we can draw a plane on the ground through AR Foundation. The plane didn't look that good, which is the default one, um, but it was awesome to see that the plane is now being detected. So the next thing we need to do is drawing the plane with our selected textures. To do that, what we need to do is just a little bit play with the, the default planes material. So if we look into the planes material, we'll see that um, we'll see that there is a mesh renderer, right, which has a material called debug plane so just click on the material you will see that this is how the material looks like there is a little yellowish albedo and this is basically a standard shader so we're just gonna follow that and create our own material so let's start by creating a new folder call it materials and I'm gonna create a new material call it floor mat and I'm just going to click on the um, prefab actually no don't do that uh, there is a better way of doing it just double click on the prefab and drag and drop the floor mat here okay so now the floor mat is basically applied to the actual air default plane prefab that's great so next we can just edit this material to show our um, desired texture so I'm going to go to the browser and search for some texture okay so I grabbed this texture from Google and then I can just simply drag and drop it inside my asset folder uh, maybe just create a folder call it texture and then drag and drop inside the texture folder okay that's great the next thing we can do now is go to our material and in the albedo we can just simply drag and drop the floor in there right we can maybe just put the metallic a little bit smoothness a little bit down so it's not that shiny and yeah that's it so now let's if we just run our project again go to edit build and run you can see that the the actual floor texture will be replaced by the new floor texture that we just